What's the best thing to say if your parents walk in on you jerking off? When I was an adolescent, the first time I had a girl in my room that my mom didn't know about I also had a few other friends over. My mom checked the game room to tell me something and they directed her to my room not sure how I'd get out of it. The door cracked, and I yelled mom I'm masturbating. My friend told this story as the best man at my rehearsal dinner. Got a good laugh, my now wife loved it. Mom turned as beet red as when I'd yelled it a decade before. Absolutely nothing. If your parents have any shred of intelligence they know that what you did was completely normal. It's nothing to be ashamed of and you should not be ashamed for doing something completely healthy and normal for a guy. Bringing it up would probably make things more awkward so I say just go on with your life and act like it didn't happen. In time the awkwardness will wear away and it'll just become a memory. Just remember to lock your door next time. The funniest saddest one I've heard. Guy hits his bedroom after a night of clubbing, pops in his porn tape to rub one out too. He falls asleep in the process, wakes up the next morning only to realize he was tucked in, and his TV was turned off. Well, needless to say, breakfast with his mom that morning was a bit awkward. Smiley face, smiley face, grimacing face. Start singing David Bowie's Space Oddity, stare at your member, and don't stop what you are doing. This is ground control to Major Tom. They will leave and never mention it. If you then ask them later if they wanted something, they will deny ever being there. Quit the masturbating, it lowers your testosterone. It also creates more anxiety. Try to find something more worth your time or turn to a religion such as Christianity so that you won't live your life in fear and in the dark. I was searching around the internet and I was downloading this thing and all of a sudden I got a computer virus and when I was getting out of my chair my pants were slipping and I was pulling them up. When I was a kid I walked in on my father rubbing one out. He said don't worry son, you'll be doing this soon. I said why, because I'm 13. He said no, because my arm's getting tired. You don't want blue balls so don't stop but you don't want your parents to think you're some kind of perv so just firmly yell I'm not coming so they don't think you're masturbating. Hey knock on the fooing door please can't you seem I'm busy? God you don't need to see this I bet they would never just walk into your room again without knocking, at least. A kid I went to high school with got lint stuck in his urethra. He was told if he couldn't pee it out, he could jerk off, because cum is thicker. So just say something was stuck. I don't know but when my dad caught me he said if you're playing with your butt, wash your hands. And then he walked out. I have never recovered from that. Got caught by my dad one time when he just barged onto my room and said a fire ant just bit my whiner, I'm just scratching it. He just nodded and left, smiley face. This kid was jerking off in the bathtub, and his dad walked in on him. The kid looked up and said don't worry daddy I'm just washing the snot out of it. It's like the book everybody poops that parents use for potty training. But now it's the kid's turn to remind the parents that everybody wanks. As a man who had this happened to him last year, I feel the only appropriate response is please tell me you have some cyanide for me. Just calmly explain to them that this is what happens when one person loves himself very much. They'll understand eventually. Hey I'm jerking here I'm jerking here up here as you son of a bitch. Congrats. You raised a pervert. Would you like to discuss this in depth or leave and forget this is happening? Exactly. Don't say anything. Just jump up in absolute shock. Trip with your own pants. Fall. Break both arms. Profit. Take a page from that one kid's playbook. My pants were slipping and I was trying to pull them up. The scouts told me if I run wood fast enough, I can possibly make a fire. Burn baby. Burn. Normally don't notice as I have headphones on but sometimes they leave me a drink on the side. Say nothing. Look them dead in the eyes and just keep going. Gotta show them who's the boss. The bomb's payload is exposed. I can use the power once to trigger a controlled explosion. Say? Don't stop just look at them and keep stroking it they walked in without knocking. What are you looking at? It won't finish by itself, and I don't need a helping hand. How many times do I have to tell you not to bother me when I'm vacuuming my room? Nothing. You make eye contact and don't stop till they leave. Establish dominance. Can you give me a minute? I need to ask credit what to say in this situation. I'm trying to get the poison out like the guy at church camp told me to. I'm having a hands-on experiment. Please leave for your own mental sanity. Mom thank god you're here. It's hard to masturbate with two broken arms. Sorry I was scratching. Only if they acknowledge the strange movement. Well I was really hoping that I'd be the only one coming in this room. If you had done this instead. We wouldn't be having this discussion. Hey, 
I'm wanking here accompanied by intense Italian hand movements. I've got pimples on my dick so I was trying to massage it with lotion. God came to me in a vision and told me that's the correct way to pray. There's a lot of online video tutorials covering this exact scenario. Loudly slap it as you say take that and don't ever spit at me again. GTFO I'm jerking off mom. Why are you taking off your shirt? This is your you didn't barge in. You wouldn't see this. I wasn't masturbating. I was just cleaning it and it went off. My. Luckily my parents are never jerking off when they walk in. That's a nice tube sock. What is that? A vintage of Tuesday. It's not just bigger than dad's. Mom. It lasts longer too. You drove 600 miles for this? Should have called first. Tell me to clean my room. But in a low, sultry voice. From you. Alright. I learned it from watching you. I'd be confused as fuck, given that they are both dead. Nothing. You make eye contact with them and keep going. Ask them to make themselves useful, and toss me a sock. Here goes another grandchild cancelled into the carpet. What are you doing in my house and how did you get in? I was getting changed. Oh good, you're here I was just thinking about you. I was waiting for you to show up. Come, come join me. Why the hell are you guys walking around jerking off? Hide the picture of my mom before anything. Oedipus. Hey, if you're going to stay, mind giving me a hand? Oh that's crazy, I was just thinking about you too. I was just performing maintenance on the equipment. Act like you are killing a spider under your sheet. I was just thinking about you. And here you are. 